How's it going guys? Butters Bridge here and welcome to another episode of my Bronze to Riches series. Um, apologies first off that there's not been an episode earlier this week. I have been suffering with a really bad uh, chest and a bit of the old man flu. Um, so my voice sounded croaky and as shitty as ever. So I decided to refrain from recording a video until now. I'm still feeling a little bit under the weather but I'm a little bit better. So I'm going to get crack on anyway and we're going to see what we've sold from the last episode. Which is these players. Uh, Shifty Cucci went for 500 coins. Um, this Brazilian went for 1.5k. Flynn Ta went for 500 coins. Uh, Riches went for 150. A bit of a, a bad one. Anamu actually went to an open bid for 750 coins, which was quite nice. The only things I've got left are these two contracts, and we are finally over a 380k mark, which is absolutely brilliant. Um, so hopefully, we're going to push on now, open some more packs, hopefully, pull something good, and work our way ever closer to the 400k mark which would be great if we can hit that by uh, some point in March so as always we're going to go into the store we are looking at bronze packs 750 coins and here is the first pack of this episode and we have got Finnegan what was that? Finnegan ah, he's not there so I'm not even interested in him uh, but we've got a couple of contracts to start off with a nice player training, which is lovely. And an all attribute card. I don't think any of them are going to be worth in anything. So we shall discard and move straight on to another 750 coin pack. And we have got Van Morsel, was that? Or something like that. Van Morsel, yeah. Um, looks pretty average. Don't think he's going to be worth that much. But we've got two more player fitnesses. That's a great start on the player fitness front. Especially with it being a, a Thursday night when I'm actually recording. I might save those things till the weekend to sell. Um, or maybe on Friday evening. Hopefully get rid of everything else in the meantime. Here's pack number three anyway. And we've got Jensen. Doesn't like his rare. So I'm not interested in any of them. But we've got two more contracts and another play fitness. That's a great start. Four from the first three packs. Hopefully we get a few more of them, and we could do we get a few rare players, and I'd be quite happy. And even a, a squad fitness would be lovely as well, as always. Here's the next pack, and we've got Tihuna, was that? Tihuna, and it is a, I thought I was going to say four star skills, but decent Moroccan player. We'll add him to the club anyway, might get a couple hundred coins hopefully for him. And a load of kits. How disgusting is that? We don't want any of them. What we do want is to push on and open another 750 coin pack. And hopefully this is better. And we've got Roberts. Roberts. It looks like there was a silver there as well. Oh, it is silver. Jason Roberts. Um, but I don't think he's worth that much. But I'll tell you what, I'll send him to the club anyway. And uh, if we get a couple hundred coins from him, that would be quite happy. We'll take all these contracts, what we've got, and we'll take this healing card and discard what is left. And move on to a, another pack. So first silver card in this one, let's see if we can get some more, that'd be nice. Ozturk is the next guy, I don't think he's rare again. Pretty poor uh, selection of players so far. Uh, Pirola, he's a pace coach, I might send him, because he possibly might be worth a bit. And we'll take these contracts as well <coughs> and then we shall discard what's left and hope 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 FIFA decide to give us something good in the next pack which is Gargula was that I don't recognize that name from anywhere uh, he's got 52 paces 4 and 2 and 2 he's 5 star weak foot possibly might be worth a bit decent formation of 5 star weak foot um, could be good even though he's bronze yeah he should still be able to get some decent shots on uh, with that guy, and we'll just discard what's left and move on to another pack. Let's see if we can pull something good. We've got Bula. Bula, is he any good? He is not the best looking card, but we've got Dabo. I think he might be worth a bit. I don't know if he's an upgraded card actually. We'll save him anyway with him being rare and have a look. Oh, big news. Um, although I do do this uh, 
account with Bronze to Riches on this account. I do open bronze packs on my main account as well, and anybody who follows me on Twitter, before I think it was at the weekend, last weekend, would have seen that I actually got an Inform card uh, on my main account, which was absolutely lovely. Um, and he was the guy who had 91 pace, I think, is it Anya or something like that? He was a right back, the Scottish guy, um, which was, I say, absolutely brilliant. Um, but from this pack, <laughs> I've just noticed we've just got another guy who looks decent. Um, 85 pace for No Byung Jun. Possibly could be worth a bit. And Al Dosari, has he got any skills now? It's a shame, he's got good dribbling as well. And we've got a couple of contracts and another player fitness. So yeah, I've got that guy, I've not sold him. Uh, I'm just keeping him in my account, because that main account, I've actually got over... I just save all the players I get, all the bronze players. I've actually got over 3,000 players now in that account, uh, which is absolutely brilliant. Um, and I'm hoping to do a series on bronze players at some point and hopefully attempt at the bronze cup within the next couple of months when as soon as I get some free time and I'm free of illnesses um, I'm hoping to bring you that series which should be a bit of good fun because uh, I'm probably going to let some of the viewers decide which countries and which leagues to look at because I've got that many bronze players now I should be able to build a team from everywhere uh, and have a player for each position but anyway we're here for the moment and we're here for more bronze packs oh I don't want to click on no then, I want to click on yes. Um, so we'll see if we can pull something good with McQuaid. Or McQuaid. Is he any good? He is not too bad. Maybe 500 coins would be lucky in a 433. And Marshall, he's a little bit better, but it's a shame about the formation. Hopefully, we'll still get us a few coins though. And we've got more contracts. What are we up to there now? 34 contracts. Oh, sorry, 34 consumables. So we've still got space for a few more packs yet. Maybe like four packs more. Let's crack on then and see if we can get something good from these last ones. Didn't even see what that said then. It was Mick something. Um, oh, we got Almasari. Oh, Moasha, sorry. Uh, 87 pace. He might be worth a bit in the, the Saudi League. And this was the guy, McChrystal. Don't think he's going to be worth much, but you never know. I will save him anyway and look up his price later. Probably just put him up 150 start price and 500 bin as usual. Um, and we'll discard what's left in that pack as we're not interested. And move on to another pack. And this one we have got Kim Young Sin. What is that? Is he a decent player? It's another pacey guy. Um, 85 pace, 4 star weak foot, 3 star skills. Again, possibly 500 coins from that guy. Which is really good. These last couple of packs have actually added a few... Actual decent players. Oh, it's a shame we got this shallow way away kit. The home kit, I think, is the one with the zebra pattern. And he's possibly worth a bit. Anyway, we'll move on to another pack. And see what we get. Al something. I'm presuming it's going to be a Saudi League one. And this guy's not quite as fast. He's only got 67 pace. Three star skills. I'll save him anyway. And, well, that's a BPL right back. I'm going to save him with his Norwich. Don't think he might, he's worth that much, but I'll always stick him at 150. Start price and maybe 300 bins, something like that, and see what we get. Um, and we'll have these coins, which is nice. And discard what's left. Quite a lot from that pack, actually. That's quite a nice pack to get. Here we go with another 750 coin pack. Probably the next to last pack, maybe. Gullerme. Is he any good? He is the Brazilian. There's only three star skills. I'm not going to be interested in him that much. <coughs> but we'll just take those two contracts and I think that's probably about it from that pack. And we'll probably call this the last pack coming up. Um, we're almost up to 50 consumables now, so we'll call this last pack and see what we get. And it was something Fernandez. I didn't see his first name. It was a bit too fast popping up. It is Mark Fernandez. Three star skills, 79 pace again. Possibility he might be a good player. And we got plenty of contracts as well in this in this last pack. Which takes us almost up to the 50, which is quite nice. So we'll discard what's left, and that is the pack opening over. Over, sorry. Um, let's go and have a look and see what we've actually got. A uh, bit of a recap, as always. First of all, we go and have a look at the players we've got, and we have got uh, Jason Roberts, who never know yeah, with him being being a Reading striker, not the paces and stuff, but I'll put we'll put 150 start price. I'm sure I might get a bid on him, hopefully. Um, no Byung Jun, hopefully he might be worth a bit. Um, Gagula, possibly with his five star weak foot. Davo, <coughs> I think he's an upgraded card. Um, Aldersari, I'm not sure. Hopefully he might get me a couple hundred coins. 
uh, Kim Young Sin. Hopefully, he'll get me a couple hundred coins as well. There's quite a few players here if you just look around. Anyway, who are possibilities of getting me some some decent coins? So hopefully, we might make a couple of k profit. Uh, hopefully, five k if we're really lucky from selling all them. Um, as far as the trade pal goes, I think we've only got one thing. Yeah, it was just a, a pace coach. We sent them. We got two contracts on last time to sell. And as always, we are going to end by looking at the consumables that I've pulled. Don't think there was any squad fitnesses in there. Don't think there's anything of real note. But we did get a couple of well, an all attribute, sorry, an all healing. We got one, two, three, four, five, six uh, fitness cards, play fitness cards, a fair few rare contracts, and as always, we end with the non rare contracts. So there you go, guys. Yeah, hopefully we can push up towards the eight, uh, three eight five k mark by the end of this episode. Um, Pretty sure we're going to get some profit once again um, from the selection of players we've got on the decent consumables. Um, please like and subscribe to my channel. Uh, I do appreciate it. and I appreciate you all being patient and waiting for this latest episode to come out. Um, but until next time, guys, I have been Butters Bridge, and I shall catch you guys later.